Hey, Jason here. I am at the Madison Area Technical College where I've just installed a brand new One Button Studio Pro. So I'm pretty excited about that. I'm going to give you a tour here and show you all the parts and pieces and how it all works together. So check it out. This is actually three different kits together here. We've got the One Button Studio Pro. We have the Zoom add-on. That's the big monitor up top. And then we have the digital light board right over here. The One Button Studio Pro, however, does come with these acoustic panels. Uh, they're really cool. They're called F-Zorb, and they do a great job of absorbing reflection. Uh, otherwise, this room would sound like a giant tin can, and the audio would just be, would just be awful. And one thing I really like about these is they're made from like 70 to 90 percent recycled water bottles. So one of the uh, nice uh, features of the One Button Studio Pro is um, this Sennheiser microphone. So we've upgraded the mic. Uh, it's really nice. It's uh, directional, so it uh, just gives you some really excellent audio. And these lights up here, these are Felix lights, and we can dial them in to match the color temperature uh, of the existing light in the room and um, also compensate for some some green in the color spectrum that these overhead lights typically have. Uh, the end result is just really nice skin tones. And speaking of video, we have this Panasonic BGH1 camera back here with a Lumix 12 to 35 millimeter lens and it's just Wow, just a beautiful, a beautiful image. So that combined with the lighting and the audio uh, just makes for a really professional uh, look. This is uh, pretty much what it looks like when the user comes in. I've got my presentation already up, my, my little demo presentation here. Um, but they'll come in and they'll see this. Pretty self-explanatory, hit the launch a session button and so what happens is the lights come on so you can see we've got our studio lights up here and our reflect media ring light which if you get right behind the camera you can see what it does it turns that screen green which is how we do all of our live compositing The next step is to just follow the on-screen instructions. Um, so load the presentation, already done over here. Configure your video with the control panel. So there's a number of different things that we can do here. One is the presentation position. So it just gives you different options for where to put your presentation. And we've got uh, background selection as well. We can cycle through this. These are just all the defaults right here. Um, each customer gets to put in their own backgrounds. One option is just shooting with a straight green screen. Uh, if somebody wants to get fancy in post and do their own thing, they can certainly do that. So I'm gonna get us back to a background here. You can pick your watermark. These are again the defaults here. There's other options. There's camera position options where um, you can set up presets for different height presenters. You can do a horizontal flip if somebody wants to see themselves in an exact mirror image. Sometimes that's easier for people to present that way. You can turn the presentation off. You can turn the green screen off if you want to. Um, there's a built-in demonstration video to help people um, know how the system works. And then there's a playback button for reviewing the recording that they've just done. So that's a, that's a quick overview of the functions there. So if uh, the presenter is happy with the layout, they can come up here behind the digital light board. And uh, they've got their clicker here to go through their uh, presentation slides. As you can see, um, when they when they start recording here on the the digital light board you can see that we have our controls 
for writing and drawing. We've got our basic colors. We've got four different preset pen sizes. We've got the freestyle scribble. We've got straight line tool, an arrow tool, an undo, and a clear all, uh, and an eraser as well. So this is just a really cool tool, just a quick quick sample. We can, you can draw really nice, uh, smooth Uh, marks on your video as you're recording and it just it records it all as part of the live video so pretty sweet so when the presenter is ready to go they just hit the floor button with their foot they get a recording countdown as you can see here and when that countdown is up then the recording light comes on the system so there's no doubt about when they are recording so as I said before they can go through their presentation, click through their slides, mark up whatever they want to with the digital light board. And when they're done with that, they would just hit the button again and the light goes out and it's indicated that the file has been copied to uh, the video folder. And I'll show you what that's about. Yep, so here's our recordings folder. So this is actually a copy. The original file is kept on the recording uh, Mac here as a backup um, for a couple of weeks before it gets overwritten. Um, but this is the, um, the file that was just recorded here. And so this can now just be dragged and dropped into, in this case, uh, they're using OneDrive. So they would just uh, log into their OneDrive and drag and drop it in there. And of course it could go into any other system as well. So that is a basic uh, overview of the One Button Studio Pro. Obviously when they're done, they hit this button again, the lights go out, the system resets itself. And it's, uh, it's automated actually if they forget to turn the lights out and nothing happens in 20 minutes, the system will uh, reset itself to the beginning state. So, so there you have it, the One Button Studio Pro here uh, at the Madison Area Technical College. Hopefully this has been helpful. Feel free to reach out with any questions. I'm happy to chat about One Button Studios.